brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. The president of a local gun owners group telling KUAM News Lieutenant Governor Ray Tenorio was not handling firearms in a safe manner when he grabbed SWAT Officer Sergeant Carl Cruz's duty weapon Saturday night at the barbecue block party in Tumon. Ken Gibbons, president of the Guam Gun Owners Association, disagreed with several things the Lieutenant Governor did at the event. You know, what the Lieutenant Governor did was dangerous for everybody around. Tenorio revealed today he does not have a valid firearms ID and Gibbons taking issue with Tenorio's handling of a loaded weapon after drinking beer. You know, when alcohol is involved, uh, you definitely don't want to be handling firearms, uh, regardless of how much training you think you have or you actually do have. Uh, firearms and alcohol never mix. Tenorio said he grabbed the gun because he was concerned it wasn't holstered properly. He offered profuse apologies today to KUAM News but continued to try and explain his actions, which he said were justified as the head of public safety on Guam. Reaching for the sidearm of an officer is dangerous. And had that officer reacted appropriately, somebody could have been injured. You know, whether the firearm was secured or not, that's not how you present in the Lieutenant Governor's eyes a teachable moment. The Guam Gun Owners Association promotes safe and responsible use of firearms and the protection of Second Amendment rights, Gibbons said. And if Tenorio had an issue with the way Sergeant Cruz was holstering his weapon, he could have addressed it differently. He should have just pulled the officer, officer aside and informed them, look, man, your firearm's not secured. Secure it. Pay attention to what you're doing. For Guam's News Network, Chris Barnett reports. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.